she did that she is me me is she i am she she is me hi guys welcome to my channel my name is moya ebele chuku <laughs> And if it is your first time here, as in the first time where you just they walk up past my door be this where you say, ah, hello, I want to come in and find out who is there. Hey, Pico, where have you been? You don't they miss road since you are welcome to my channel. And if you are an OG, <laughs> welcome back. So today we're going to be, of course, I'm going to be showing you this amazing look, how I achieved it, everything that happened and I know say when I don't the eye the hair, no wahala. Okay, so for the hair details, it will be in the next video. This one will just be mainly makeup and I promise to tell you everything about the hair. If you do want to learn about this, so just leave that in the comment section below, okay? Hold on, pause. Before you continue, you can see this, you like it. Me and you know say you like her. For that your heart, for your mind, you know say you like her. You like me. You already like my energy. Subscribe. It's free. The only thing you have to just do is use your hand and press that button. Welcome. Subscribe. It's free. Happy New Year, I forgot to say. Okay, so we're starting off with using the Maybelline Concealer. I'll leave all the information down below. And I was just here blabbing about how if you don't have a pillow um, base, you can use this. Okay. So we're going to the Jaclyn Hill palette and we're using that shade right there. First of all, we're setting this down first as like, I don't know, as like the mini base. So I know that I want like an undertone of that somewhere, but not particularly at the top. Now, I'm trying to look up. And see where to add more because if you have hooded eyes um, you need to look up because once you cut the crease most part of all the colors you've laid down will be gone so that is me adding more of that color to the top because I want it to show okay so basically yeah now we're going into this neon color in green and I'm using at the top it's going to be messy, so if you're going to do this look, I advise you to do your eyeshadow before you do your foundation. And you just tap, 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 and continue tapping. Um, you can see as I tapped it and I blended it, some of it faded off, so I kept going into more. Until I, oh my god, like, this transition is so nice. Like, the way, do I say blue? bluish green went into that neon green i don't know i just loved it now to cut the crease we all know this that you place it on your eyelids and look up and wherever that stops you cut the crease but do this twice because sometimes the first time it only goes a bit and make sure you put it very well on your lid so that when you look up you're able to see where it starts from so when you place it on your lid, you look up like two times or three times to ensure that it's in the right place. And then you cut your crease. You need to do this if you have hooded eyelids. If not, when you pull your lashes, nothing will show. I'm going into this palette by Ofra and it's a highlighter, but I love the way it really shows. So I use that to set the concealer. Now we're going into this by Blossom Makeup and I'm using that um, black there. You can see that I'm building it slowly. I was tapping it in gently because it's black and it can get really messy so fast. So ensure that you go in bit by bit. Be careful. And the rest, I took it forward. I did not add any more product. I just used whatever was left on the brush to kind of brush it in a bit so it looks united or the same and i took more of that blue to you know color the outer part this is just all blending so that it just looks like one color i don't know if you get what i mean and eyeliner basically you just watch what i'm doing and you should get it so yes if you want to add in a tutorial let me know but i'm sure that this video pretty much covers it and yeah, I'm so sorry that I have to do a voiceover. That's why it's not as exciting as my bubbly self. 
I did have myself recorded, but only for me to listen to this and girl, the background noise was not it. You wouldn't have liked me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, we're going into this Chunky Glitters by EA Beauty and Queen and that is my eyelash glue. I get it 500 naira from Balugu Market. So first of all, I'm laying down the glue. I have problems with laying down Chunky Glitters and this is a glitter from the dollar store. Yeah, I really like the reflection. So this was me putting it on with my hand and you can see the mishap that happened. See, it was like I was dragging the skin away, like the whole base that I've worked for can you imagine so I just gave up and I used the brush instead instead of my hands I used the brush to lay the chunky glitters it's always a hit and miss for me and chunky glitters <laughs> at this point I was tired you can see like I was fed up I'm just showing you guys the two I use so I use this mascara by younger beauty I love this so much I love it so much amount of it but yeah it's amazing honestly and yeah um so for dark spots i find out that it works better for me when i use a darker foundation on the dark spots because there is no way it's, it's the dark spot is going to pick through a dark foundation do you get the vibe you get it so yeah i'm going to leave it for a few minutes which i i don't think i showed here but after you leave it for a few minutes then you dab yeah don't just like blend immediately and that's all Keep your ice cream covers because you can use it as a fan. <laughs> I'm using my NYX Can't Stop One Stop. I'm going to write the shade of everything for you down in the description box. Okay, don't worry. I was scared that it was too light, but no, I usually get that mistake. My neck is fairer, my hands are fairer than my face. So yeah. And also foundation oxidizes sometimes, so it might get darker along the way. I will just leave you to watch the rest of this and just enjoy. The eye was the main thing for my hooded eyelid girls. So if there's any question you want or you have, you can ask me. And if I wasn't as detailed enough, don't mind me. It's because it's a voiceover. But I could do another one for you, my loves. Okay? So just watch and enjoy. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video i hope you enjoyed it as much as i enjoyed this video i can't believe i did this i still can't believe i bodied this wig and this look guys i love you guys and please make sure you share this video you like you comment it will mean so much to me and i hope to see you next time hopefully we have more gist maybe a new wig maybe another color i don't know i don't know anything you have questions about just leave it in my description down in the comment section and i'll be sure to answer you i love you guys bye